Hello everybody, welcome to Mike's Mike, my name is Mike. And today's episode of Essential Viewing is brought to you by my side splitting headache. Now this is no normal headache. Some could say she is a migraine. Um, some could say that I am in pain, perhaps. If you're not familiar with Essential Viewing, it's a series that I started where I talk about my favorite reality TV scenes. And I mean, for this one today, you know, if you look up headache remedies, on like the internet, this is what comes up. It says to look at hotel hell highlights and in particular hotels in and specifically the poop on the floor moment. The title of this video is owner admits to and then caps not cleaning her own diarrhea hotel hell. I put the link in the description if you want to watch along with me. Two things I'm going to be squinting a lot because I can't really see properly because my head hurts so much. And second thing, this frame is what starts the video and it's just like a great sign of what's to come. You know, wearing gloves, holding some kind of electronic device in some nasty crusty looking hotel with a really outrageous amount of text on a painting on the wall or a picture. Cool, so without further ado, let's get popping. When this thing reads 30, it indicates that it's a sort of um, a, a decent level of hygiene. Basically it's clean anything over 30, then it gets into the danger zone. This meter right here tells me how much poop is in the air and if it's over 30 then we're going to burn the whole hotel down. This is where the smell is really bad in here. There's crap everywhere. It's just so unhygienic. <laughs> Sorry. Now this is kind of gross but that specific sentence This is where the smell is really bad is burned into my brain and I hear it in my head every single time I walk into the work toilets. No further information given. To get a good reading, rub the swap underneath the mat. The smell under here is appalling. What in fresh hell, or what in fresh hotel hell, is that bathroom? Like, what raggedy ass bathroom with this raggedy ass curtain down the middle with this raggedy ass toilet and this raggedy ass basin? Get that far exit door, I'm off. In these crevices, there's dirt. That is gross. That is disgusting. That is gross. That is disgusting. Him lifting the mat is making him like almost gag and I'm just trying to like imagine that and combine with my headache slash migraine moment. I think I would just pass out. I think I'd just pass out. Also when his sister scooped out that little bit of dirt from that thing I was like hmm. No. Snap it. Let the liquid go down. Shake. I don't know what else to tell you. Gordon Ramsay is an educational science legend. Like, put it in, snap it, let the liquid go down. In. Holy crap. Holy crap. Literally. I'm not sure when this place was clean properly. Nasty. Oh my god. Karen. In. Oh my god. Karen. I've just done a swab test with the carpet. I told her the smell is gross. Anything above 30. Look, I'm not gonna be Karen shaming here, but I'm just saying, did this episode come before or after the movie Brave? That's all I'm gonna say. You know what? Let's give all the main characters names. On the left, this guy kind of looks like a me custom character. Then we've got Brave. Then we've got, I don't know why, I just wanna call her Better Homes and Gardens. And then the lady on the right, she just kind of looks like she came from the set of MasterChef. So we're gonna call her MasterChef. Anything above 30. You're in the danger zone for unhygienic practices and it's not fit for customers. What do you think the reading is? A hundred. A hundred. <laughs> Anything over 30 is unhygienic and is not fit for customers. What do you think the reading is? Uh, a hundred. MasterChef came to drag Better Homes and Gardens and Brave. Like she's like, look at that face. She's taking no prisoners. 50. 50. 60. 70. 70. 803. <laughs> 803. These honeys, the squad, the four horsemen of the apocalypse came out with an 803. MasterChef looks like she's having a stroke. Better Homes and Gardens looks like she's drinking from an imaginary straw. Brave looks like she's low key shitting herself. Watch what happens next. And me character has been eliminated from the competition. 803. Oh my God. Oops. 803. Oops. Burn it. That's not it. Oops, that Burn it. 
down. Burn it down. Burn it down. Slightly off topic, but this could have been what my mum said yesterday morning when she put bread rolls in the oven and then forgot they were there and then they lit on fire and there was like actual fire in my oven and then we opened the oven and the flames went out and we nearly burned it down. It smells like there's crap all over the floor. Probably because there's crap on the floor. Probably. Could be. What does that mean, could be? Smells like crap on the floor. Probably because there is. Probably. My first shift here, you were in the bathroom and I think you had an accident on the floor, on the mat. What? Oh my God. I mean, yeah. There have been times when I have had diarrhea, but it doesn't happen very often. There have been times when I've had diarrhea and it doesn't happen very often. Gordon's just like, what the fuck? But also, this is great for my show. This is a travesty. This is shocking. Your staff knows it, but you two are oblivious. But the rest of the room is dusted and clean. Honestly, this is just like a normal internal monologue in my head when I find like a mess somewhere in my apartment and then the other part of my brain's like, the rest of the room is clean and dusted. Things that this place is, crusty, dusty, musty. Things that this place is not, trusty. I like you want to stay there though. I want to see like what all the fuss is about and bring my own little poop monitor. I am not sleeping in this dump. I'm done. I'm out of here. Oh man. You can't leave. I'm not staying in here. Ramsey, don't go. Ramsey. Don't go! Cool, I hope you guys enjoyed this lesser known Gordon Ramsay Hotel Hell clip. Uh, the previous episode of Essential Viewing, I talked about Big Boss, specifically the Pudger What Is This Behaviour scene. So if you want to go and watch that, there's a link in the description. If you can think of any iconic reality TV scenes you want me to talk about, let me know in the comments. I've got some America's Next Top Model. I've got a whole bunch of everything coming up. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. I would much appreciate it. And the algorithm would love that too. And if you're not subscribed already, hit that subscribe button. Um, my subscribe account is still being problematic. Like, there's a lot of red. You know, let's just say that there's a lot of red. And I'll see you guys soon in a couple of days. A peace out. A bye.